Now we discuss eigenvalues and eigenvectors of a square matrix capital A. Eigen means characteristic. Let capital A be an n by n square matrix. A non-zero vector capital X bar is an eigenvector of capital A. If capital A into X bar is equal to lambda into X bar for some scalar lambda. If given matrix capital A and X bar satisfies this equation, then this uh, X bar is called the eigen vector of the matrix capital A and this scalar value is called the eigen value of the matrix capital A. This scalar may be real number or complex number. A scalar lambda is an eigen value or characteristic value of the matrix capital A. If there exists a non-trivial solution, non-trivial solution means non-zero solution of this system Ax is equal to lambda x, such a solution is called the called an eigenvector corresponding to the eigenvalue lambda. Now we have to find eigenvalues and eigenvectors of a square matrix capital A. Finding eigenvalues and eigenvectors of a square matrix capital A. If the homogeneous system A minus lambda i into x is equal to O has a non-trivial solution, then the rank of the quotient matrix A minus lambda i is less than n. That is, the quotient matrix A minus lambda i must be singular. That is, debt of A minus lambda i is equal to 0. Find its debt is equal to 0. The debt of A minus lambda is equal to 0 is called the characteristic equation of the matrix capital A. Expanding the determinant A minus lambda i, we will obtain a polynomial of degree n in the lambda, which is of the form lambda to the power n minus c1 into lambda to the power n minus 1 plus c2 into lambda to the power n minus 2 plus n so on minus 1 whole to the power n into c sub x n is equal to 0. We get an nth degree polynomial in the variable lambda. Say that is p sub x n of lambda is equal to 0. This equation is called the characteristic equation of the matrix capital A. The polynomial equation p sub x n lambda has n roots which may be real or complex, simple or repeated. The roots lambda 1 comma lambda 2 comma and so on lambda suffix n of the polynomial equation p suffix n lambda is equal to 0 are called the eigenvalues or characteristic values of the matrix capital A. Spectrum of a matrix. Let capital A be a square matrix of order n. The set of all eigenvalues is called the spectrum of the matrix capital A. Note, the largest eigenvalue in magnitude is called the spectral radius of the matrix capital A and it is denoted by rho of A. Note 2, if data of A is equal to 0, that is the matrix is singular, then one of the eigenvalues of A must be 0. After determining the eigenvalues lambda i, we solve the homogeneous system A minus lambda i into i capital A minus lambda i into capital i into x is equal to O for each lambda to obtain the corresponding eigenvectors x i. That is substitute lambda 1 in a minus lambda 1 into i into x is equal to o. We get an homo we get a homogeneous system of linear equations. Solve this homogeneous system. We get uh, a non-trivial solution x1. This x1 is a, a non-trivial solution of this uh, homogeneous system of linear equation. This x1 is called the eigenvector of a corresponding to the eigenvalue lambda 1. Next uh, Substitute eigenvalue lambda 2 in the e in a minus lambda 2 into i into x is equal to o. Solve this system of linear equations. We get a solution say that is x2. This x2 is a eigenvector of a corresponding to the eigenvalue lambda 2. Find all the eigenvectors x1, x2, x3 and so on xn corresponding to the eigenvalues lambda 1, lambda 2, lambda 3 and so on lambda n. 